Conrad here, Buzz TV. CES 2024, and looky, looky, we're back with Hypervision. Absolutely. And we love Hypervision, we've been here for years, but you guys have some incredible new stuff this year. We do, we are all about the holographic experience, and it's more than just seeing something in 3D, it's interacting with it, it's having fun with it, it's being immersed in it. And with this, I see there's a way you could actually live stream, because there's someone right there, and you could see that they were behind us on the green screen, and they were live streamed Absolutely. away. Yep. Now with that, what is the, could I use like any camera to connect to the system, or is there a special Hypervision camera There's ID. not a special Hypervision camera. You can use any camera, but we do sell it, you know, some of this is third party, but we do sell it as a kit if people want that, just so that they have it ready to go. But you can use your own systems for sure. Now for something like this, if I'm correct, three, six, nine, 12, 15 units? Three, six, nine, 12, 15. On this one, there are, yes. Now, are there ways to do the live stream with less amount of units, let's Absolutely. say. Absolutely, you can use our holographic human, and that's much more life size, right? And then you can also, you know, if you wanted to, you could live stream to a single display and just have somebody's face talking. See, now that's an amazing thing. And you've seen, we've used the units when we're interviewing bands and we have a single unit. Now, what is the price point for, I guess, to be able to live stream for this sort of thing. So our live stream is a subscription package, right? So because it's a software, proprietary software, but this whole kit, if you bought it on the market, would be about $131,000. That's everything including, that you see here. Including if the If you fans. just wanted, uh, if you bought it at CES, you get 20% off. Oh, there you go. <laughs> Um, but it does have to be bought at CES, and then, um, but the holographic human as a, a, you know, human size is, you know, it's all modular, so if anybody wants a quote, they can contact us on our website and we'll give it to them. And what is the lovely website so they know? It is hypervsn.com, H-Y-P-E-R-V-S-N. And you're going to love it because they have so many things, and once you become a customer, and again, we have a unit. The support is incredible. Absolutely, 24-7. I was just gonna say 24-7, believe it. Two, three in the morning, I've got online <laughs> and someone actually helped me out. They have stuff that you could use. You could make your own video and port it into the system. But this year with this new live streaming stuff, and you can see some people on there, it just looks so good. Yeah. Um, and you know, the truth is, live stream for us does not have to be local. Like, it's not a gimmick just at a show where people get to see themselves. We've live streamed executives across the world to accept an award, to perform, to speak, to be on a panel. They can hear the audience, they can respond. It's very cool. You know, and I was about to say that for the entertainment industry, there are so many doors that this could actually open up and the possibilities are truly amazing. And it all comes down to really your imagination and what you want to do. Exactly, I always say you're only limited by your imagination. Now there's some other fun stuff and you're gonna see that video. The gaming, I see there's roulette now. Yeah, we have, you know, we're all about the immersive interactive experience. So we've created some various things, obviously, the live stream, the roulette is live. We've got also an interactive window display that shows people being able to take a 3D model and turn it with their hands and move things around. It's really cool. Yeah, we saw that I think a few years ago. Yeah, absolutely. And we used the Leap Motion device uh -huh. to do that. We actually owned the Leap Motion. That's why it was fun. That's it's like great. we knew everything That's about great. it. And, and it is so nice that you can take your hands and move a model or let's say medically. I've seen the heart model where you can move it and open it up. Yes. So there are so many different possibilities. And in the front of the booth, that girl is amazing. 
The digital avatar, this is, um, has been a game changer for people, especially after COVID, people have staffing issues. They want someone who can just answer all of the repetitive questions that everybody asks all the time. And the digital avatar has been that solution for so many. It's chat GPT and AI enabled and customizable. Just like an avatar in a video game, you can change the hair, change the clothing based on a library of features that we have. So. And, and again, that could all be modular depending on how large you want this to be. Right now, the digital avatar is only in the holographic human size. Okay. Uh, yeah, it's pretty cool. And again, you can find all the fun stuff and the price points for all that. Just go to the website. You'll see it down here. There's links in the descriptions as well. And that's the best place you could talk to someone, get a custom package that is right for you. Exactly. We customize everything. And, the, and, and also, don't forget, if you're not good with making video or creating video, Hypervision will work with you and create a package that is, one, unique for just for you, and just what you want because they're so good. Exactly. I mean, every piece of content that you see here, up there, everywhere on the booth that is not the live stream, that is um, from our design lab, who are very stellar. They're amazing. And again, the Mike Flag stuff, other than the logos, that's all their stuff because we're able to use their stuff and build packages as well. So again, they are so user friendly. Uh, and I really couldn't couldn't push that any harder or farther that they are probably one of the best user-friendly companies with tech support, products, product development, and helping you create your own video. So much. We're, we're a complete platform and we're there to support our clients. Absolutely. This was truly a great visit for us because we love the live stream and we know a few people that are going to love this live stream all the stuff you guys just saw and there's so much more so don't forget get on their website hypervision it's a great company for us it's ces 2020 for hypervision buzz tv we're out of here guys see ya Later. be right here buzz tv ces 2024 and we're at sk wonderland and it looks like we're in a giant amusement park now we're going to find out what this is and what they do and then we're going to go take a fun adventure. So we're with our friend Kayla and Kayla's going to tell us what SK Wonderland is. So the SK Wonderland has a theme park adventure to it. Uh, we have a lot of technology that is helping create a net zero future by 2030, the year 2030. That is the goal here. We were still on board with that same goal last year. We have the train here that uses uh, renewable energy. Um, we have AI fortune telling using semiconductor technology. We also have the dancing car and we have the magic carpet ride which shows like the future of um, traveling. <laughs> I so, forgot the word for that. I'm sorry. That's okay. Air mobility. Got yes. <laughs> and you also have a spear now for us that yes. are locals here. There's a big deal about this spear over at the Venetian. Yes. But as you see, that technology is not limited to them. No. Nope. And it's all about creative content because I see some great 3D content on oh, here. Yes. Like the the moon. Mm -hmm. um, and so, and a few other things which maybe some of their people might see and try to steal because I like your content. It's really yes. nice on there. Yes. Now, if we want to learn about SK Wonderland and all the ways you could be renewable, where do we find them? Now, I know there's some hashtags. Yes, there are some hashtags, SK Wonderland, that you can find more content and more information. There is also a QR code here. And you can also Google SK Technology. And that's the best thing. And what we'll do, we'll do a... A, a nice big picture of the QR code so if you guys are at home yes. pull your phone out you can hit that QR code but again we're gonna run around we're definitely riding the train I've been yes <laughs> just so you know because a lot of people know what I do I was building this thing since December 18th I've been running around the, these convention halls and I've actually worked on the booth right next to Wonderland so I knew about a spear and I knew about a train I didn't know about these other things we're gonna ride but all of us with Buzz TV, we're gonna go ride a train now.
Kayla, I appreciate everything. Of course. We love all this stuff. Don't forget your passport. Oh, yep. You're going to need <laughs> one of these, guys. So we got our passports. We're going to ride. And we'll see you soon. So now we're off on the train. I'm seeing the Rachel. But let's see what's happening with the train. Looks like we're going into tunnels. Right here buzz tv ces 2024 we made it over to west hall these are where electric cars are but we've got the xping flying car this is actually a working model the wings will fold into it the uh, pod goes down and it's just a normal roof but this car is actually a working model it is going into production in Q4 of 2024 and is actually looking at a release date of 2025. Now we'll have links down here to the website for this, but another really cool thing here at CES 2024. Just look at that thing. Be right here, Buzz TV, CES 2024. Where are we? We're at Insta360. Now we came to talk about some really fun specific stuff. But after multiple occasions stopping at the booth, being told to wait for a specific party for ooh, an hour, and then handed a business card, needless to say, we're not too thrilled. So we're going to start off with customer service, horrible at best. 
The reason I'll say that is we do have an Insta360 product, and when I had to ask about something, there's no phone number to call. You have to send an email to tech support, and maybe they'll get back to you in a reasonable time frame. But if, God forbid, you had an emergency, and you needed emergency tech support, there is none. So, what we are going to say is Insta360 does have some really nice products. Their VR cameras seem great, but again, we can't get anyone to talk to us about that. Um, we do use one of the little cameras that we've instituted into the guitar camera, so you'll see that when we're shooting the 4K package, and you'll see that going right down the fretboard of either guitars or basses. So with that product, we will say that is a winner. Other stuff, again, can't get anyone to talk to us. So we'll just leave it with that. So for myself, at CES 2024, at Insta360, as I'm standing alone, we're out of here, guys. See ya.